What career is the lowest of the low? That person who wants to talk to me about my car's warranty. MLM recruiter. Paparazzi. Illegal. Scammer. Legal. Phone annoyer. Sex traffickers. There really is no lower scumbag piece of shit. Reddit admin. TV evangelist. Senior members of the clergy who decide not to press charges against kiddie fiddling priests. Parasitical politicians. Mega church pastors and any pastor that preaches the prosperity gospel. Some examples would be Kenneth Copeland, Jimmy Swaggart, Joel Osteen, Creflo Dollar, and many, many more. Scum of the fucking earth. Not sure if it's a career, but human traffickers. Pimp. A grave digger. Hey, they do go lower than ground level. In Australia, real estate agents. I used to draw fan art for a living back in college. It was a lot more money than any other job I could have gotten at the time since I was more than all right with drawing the weird shit. I drew a lot of pony porn during the brony era and tons of furry and anime girls. I guess it's up to user interpretation what is and isn't the lowest I didn't mind drawing porn at all. Even didn't mind a lot of the fetishes. I had a guy who would obsess over me drawing paws so I'd draw the best paws ever. What was the lowest in my opinion was when someone offered me an absurd amount of money for a cub. Commission. Like I'd charge 70 for a fully detailed piece and he was offering me 650. For those not in the furry no. Cub is basically furry kid. But I was 20 something and wanted a new PC so I said fuck it and did it. Then he told his friend I do these commissions and offered me another giant commission check. Before I knew it I was drawing Cub and Falcon from the brony scene. Same deal just little kid ponies. Making more money than I knew what to do with. Lonely programmers with this type of fetish have a lot of disposable income. My highest paid piece was straight up $2,000. Five characters. I spent around 15 hours on it and was so psyched to be making so much an hour. I say it like it was all good rollin' in money era. But it wasn't. That shit takes a toll on you. I'd always get grossed out. Not just by the content I was drawing. But by the people commissioning it. Some seemed relatively normal despite the fetish. But others were straight up freaky. The nail in the coffin was when someone sent me a picture of an actual kid in a swimsuit and wanted me to redraw that as a furry. Before then I'd only ever received references of their actual characters they wanted drawn. I didn't care cause it's just a drawing and I was making bank so it's whatever. But pulling a real life image on me like that was too far. I told him no and said I'm no longer taking those commissions. That entire community seemed to rebel at this point with money and offered me absurd amounts for stuff to stick around. I'll be honest. I almost cracked at some of those. In the end though I moved on and just did regular furry for a bit until I finished my degree and quit taking commissions altogether. I wish I could draw for a living since I hate my current career now and drawing 15 hours a week. Then having all the free time in the world was amazing. But I know where the real money is in those fandoms accounts are closed and I've moved on. Paparazzi. Celebrities just want privacy like everyone else. Scam callers. They prey on older folks and steal their money. Their career is quite literally to steal from society's sweetest and most vulnerable people. I don't know how I could sleep at night knowing I ruin lives for a living. Medical debt collector. Politicans that just mindlessly go with the crowd that goes against the best interests of the people for votes. At least people working with actual shit are participating positively to society. Seal clubber. Door-to-door -door sales. They're rampant in my country. 
they are so overpriced. I feel bad for the housewives that get suckered into buying the crap that they sell. Reddit mod and part-time dog walker. Facebook live moderator. Scammers especially those that prey on the elderly. Not my opinion but, Bill Hicks on marketing. HTTPS colon slash slash www.youtube.com slash watch. V equals the OGRKHDP0. NSFW. For profit jail. FNAF security guard. This dude is literally making 120 a week loudly crying. MLM founder. Nursing assistant. Shit on. Baffed on. Threatened. Punched. Understaffed. And everything is your fault for just barely above minimum wage. Paparazzi are the lowest of them all. Fucking scumbags. Their job is literally harassing celebrities. For profit hospice. Pharmaceutical CEOs. Politician. Politicians. IRS. Corporate lobbyist. Telephone sanitizer. We should ship them all off to some remote planet. Assistant crack whore. Credit to Norm MacDonald. Sewer inspector cleaner. I did that. I would lay up at night and smell human shit. I I guess it was stuck in my nose. Never again. Lobbyist for Facebook. Hitman. Deep sea diver.